Let's talk about the forecast for today. We've got 50s for today and for tomorrow. It does feel like fall. We do have fall like weather in the form of some clouds as well and a few sprinkles this morning or maybe even a light shower. I think at times we could see some rain come down, but it's going to be more of a sprinkle and drizzle than anything else. And then hoping to get some clearing overnight to call it partly cloudy skies for tomorrow, but that could lead to some chilly temperatures during the overnight hours. Here's where we sit currently. The clouds holding us in the 40s for almost all locations. The exception is along the Indiana side where there are some warmer temperatures into the 50s. This is that rain that is falling being picked up by radar, but that is not necessarily reaching the ground, not in all locations. There are a few spots where rain is being reported. I think this will be kind of off and on a sprinkle or a drizzle through the day. I think we'll pick it back up during the afternoon as well as the temperatures through about 10 a.m. get to around 50 degrees and then into the low to mid 50s for the rest of the day. Here's midday. You see and notice a, a couple of sprinkles here and there again, not a washout not something that's going to have to change your plans. Just know that if you see a few sprinkles or drizzle, uh, that's kind of what we're expecting for the day today. And then starting to see some clearing after our high temperature reaches the mid 50s so that by the time we get into the overnight, as the winds die down, as the skies clear, that's the perfect conditions with dry air in place to see our temperatures drop. And I do think we'll see some low to mid 30s across the area away from the city. The urban heat island and the lake will likely keep temperatures just a little bit warmer uh, for Chicago. And then tomorrow we're back into the 50s. Let's call that partly cloudy skies, but there is a warm up on the way. It's subtle, but into the 60s by the time we get to Wednesday and Thursday, but that's when the rain chances also begin to creep back in. So by Thursday, a good chance that we'll see some scattered showers. I think the chance is high, but the amounts aren't necessarily very high. That will change for Friday. The rain chance is still a little bit questionable because it's out six days, even though uh, 66 years have passed since we saw that weather map. We still have some uncertainty when we get out six or seven days, but I do think the rain chances is uh, going to be there and it could be heavy rain at times. And for the entire seven day period, our forecast is certainly going to feel like fall.